one more year until we can officially call ourselves doctors. Uh, we both attend Toro College of Medicine. We're both fourth years. And we've been living together basically since day one. I like to buy masks, really scary and funny masks. We've got about three in the house. And we have puppies at home too, and they hate the masks too. We do so many things together, and that it's awesome that you're there for literally all of it. Yeah. You know, we study together, we work out together, we go out together. Um, I don't know how it would have been going through medical school at all if it wasn't for medical school you know, would have sucked. Like you, yeah, it would. Oh, well, it's still, it was tough. It, it still sucked. sucked. But yeah, it sucked. It still sucked a little bit. Loved it, but it sucked. <laughs> uh, this past summer, we took a trip together. We went to South America, went to Argentina and Peru. We climbed up to Machu Picchu. Five-day intensive nature trek. I thought I was going to die. That my friend recommended. Actually, and. <laughs> This trek was for like seasoned athletes, and we were not at the time at all. Still, we're still not. We're lucky that it, it does click so well because you know a lot of roommates don't, and it's been you know for the best. And this year we've been for last year we've been fortunate enough to have the same exact rotation schedule, which was even better. So basically the entire year we were on the same uh, clerkships every single month, which is really crazy because yeah. it was a lottery, and we just randomly got assigned the same exact schedule. It's destiny. <laughs> but yeah, we click really well. We live well together. We're both super clean. Obviously, our dogs get along. As, I don't know. I have no complaints at all. And just having someone to study with and work out with and kind of go through this because I you know people hear about how hard and challenging medical school is, but they honestly can't put it into words. I mean, there's some some months at a time where you just don't sleep and you just wake up feeling like you're a crazy person because you have to study for the next 14 hours and it's I don't know, having, having someone there makes it all a little bit more tolerable. So starting in your third year of medical school is when you start to see patients uh, with, with resident supervision. So that was uh, about a little over a year ago today. And we've been rotating through different specialties like internal medicine, family medicine. And yeah, we've been in a, a lot of different hospitals in the area. We've learned a lot about you know, the, the medical system and seeing patients on our own. And you know, that's invaluable experience. We work with Cherokee, we're ambassadors. We uh, like to showcase their scrubs. I think they're really just phenomenal. They fit well. Yeah, we love the scrubs. We wear them to work. And they've been, they've been incredible to us, and I hope we've been able to contribute you know, a little bit, a little bit as well.